Welcome to our coverage of the final here at the Euros. My name is Derek Ray, sitting here on the commentary gantry, and with me to provide expert analysis, a complete tactical breakdown, is Stuart Robson. What a match this promises to be. It's France versus Croatia. Well, Derek, I'm really excited by these two teams. There are some top-class players all over the pitch and some really good matchups. This could be a great final today. Let's hope so. Excellent vision, but ably intercepted, but it looked as though they might be in. And the starting 11 for Croatia. Marcelo Brozovic plays with Luka Modric in central midfield. And leading the line today is Andrej Kramaric. An exciting talent who has everything a forward needs to be successful. Stuart, what are you expecting to see from Mbappe? Well, Derek, over the years he's scored so many goals. It's his ability to come short and then spin in behind defenders at such pace. When the ball's played in behind, nobody catches him and he often gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper and we know what the result is. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Andrei Kramaric. But it stopped a promising attack in its tracks and you wouldn't be surprised if there's a card coming out here. Well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate over that one. It's a yellow card all day long. Oh, good strike! Well, not quite the tantalising free kick he was hoping for. Goalkeeper's ball. Kunde. Well, they're trying to get right into his face. And he read it well defensively. And it's the vision of Griezmann coming to the fore. Oh, could be a chance! And cleared away. Promising move this from France. Dembele. And players waiting in the centre. This might be ideal for the counter. Andrei Kramaric. Not the pass he had in mind. Theme emerging of wasted possession. And France finding space on the flank. So well to deny him. <laughs> Played in by Griezmann. Is he going to score? Was an important piece of defending. It's a perfect challenge. Now counter-attacking possibilities. Can they profit from this? Chance to take the lead. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. And in by Luka Modric. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. Danger averted for now, but it'll be another corner.
Luka Modric with the corner. And making sure it wasn't problematic. Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. And the match is underway. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Perfect challenge. Passing like that, part of Luka Modric's game. Modric! And up for grabs off the keeper. Well, thank goodness for the goalkeeper. Well, they're calm now, but that initial save was absolutely magnificent. And the referee playing advantage. Good visualisation and execution. Zero! And striking it on the volley, just no luck. Well, good technique, but just wide of the target. Well, he's gone into the referee's notebook. And he can't be surprised. That was a poor challenge, you have to say. Mateo Kovacic. And showing the importance of win. Kovacic. Kramaric. Wasteful from France. Odric. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. We can get more details on that injury situation from our man pitch side, Jeff Shreves. Jeff? 50-50 this one. He twisted his knee. He's been trying out, but I'm not sure he can carry on. Cheers, Jeff. Plenty of power, but just too much height on it. Mateo Kovacic. Oh, he's given the ball away. Rabio. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Look at Modric with the pass. Finish it! Oh, there it is! There's the goal that gives them the lead. Just what they wanted. First of all, where's the defending? They're all over the place, but give him some credit. That's a good finish. Great composure. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Ten minutes left for play. Upamecano. Dembele, it needs an accurate cross, just had to keep his concentration to the maximum, and he did. Can they hit on the break? Need to get back quickly here, oh, magnificent reaction. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. Well, he's beaten his opponent. And there goes the final whistle. Croatia have won the Euros on this dramatic night here in Berlin. The joy, the ecstasy, also the disappointment, but ultimately the feeling of togetherness. Well, I have to say, they've been brilliant throughout the tournament. They were great today as well. They are the deserving champions, no doubt about that. And these are very special scenes that we're witnessing.
And now with the pressure off, a chance to reflect, a chance to celebrate, the trophy about to be presented. The European champions, Croatia! What a great moment for these players, absolutely brilliant.